I was so excited. My mom chose me to be her maid of honor, and I feel so privileged that I get to help both of my parents on their special day. Whew, I'm crying already. <laughs> Well, my mom has been by my side through everything since the beginning. She's the person I come to for everything and the person I look up to the most. She's my role model and has influenced my life so much and I couldn't imagine my life without her. I know I'm safe when I'm with her and I can count on her for anything and I can't remember a single time that I've turned around and not seen her right behind me, supporting me and cheering me on through life. You're the best mother a girl could ever ask for and I'm so happy that you brought Brent into our lives because Brent, <laughs> I love you more than you probably already know, and you've made such a dramatic impact on my life. I was so fortunate to have a father figure blessed into my life, and you need to know how lucky I feel to have you on the other side of me walking me through life. I don't tell you as much as I should, but I really appreciate you and all that you've done for me over the years. The first time I met you, I was a little scared, but I can proudly say today that the last nine years with you in my life are the years that have borne me into the person I am today. I've known this for a while, and I hope you know too how blessed I feel to call you my dad, and I really hope I can make you proud of being your daughter. When you first told me that we needed to write a letter to each other for our wedding day, I wasn't sure what I would say, how I would say it, or even how I would start. After collecting my thoughts, the question then became how I sum up my love for you in the short context of this letter, a near impossible task. Let me start by saying all kids dreams of their future. Dreams change as you get older, wiser, and the amount of importance that one places on certain things changes accordingly. Well, when I met you, my dreams changed. My dream now is to be an amazing, supportive, caring husband to you and an equally wonderful father to our kids. I would say that after today, I am one step closer to realizing that dream. But I have already been living that dream for the last 10 years. I owe all this to the love that you, Taylor, and Gavin have given me. You two now stand before relatives, friends, and before God to promise to share your lives together until death do you part. This is a permanent commitment to love and to honor one another in good times and bad, in poverty and in plenty, in sickness and in health, for better or for worse. Now these are serious vows that you will make. A marriage that lasts for a lifetime demands love and loyalty, trust and unselfishness, along with God's grace. I, Brent. Take you, Anne. Take you, Anne. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. And I do promise 
And I do promise. Before God. Before God. And these witnesses. And these witnesses. To be your loving. To be your loving. And faithful husband. And faithful husband. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. I, Ann. Take you, Brent. Take you, Brent. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. And I do promise. And I do promise. Before God. Before God. And these witnesses. And these witnesses. To be your loving and faithful wife. To be your loving and faithful wife. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Gavin and Taylor, you have a special place in this marriage. For your lives will be touched by the promises made by your mother and father today. Your participation will be needed to continue the growth and the bonds of this family. Well, as a symbol of individuals joined as one unit today, a special medallion will now be presented to each of you as you receive your token of family unity. Always remember that love, that love that has brought all of you together and that love that will guide you and nurture you throughout your years ahead. As a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I declare that Brent and Anne are now husband and wife according to the ordinances of God and the laws of the state of Illinois. And I would pray that the Lord bless you and keep you and make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you this day and forevermore. You may kiss the bride. I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Baker. Dear Brent, we have waited so long for this day. As I sit here trying to pull all of my feelings into words, I find it more difficult than I initially thought. Where do I even start? I knew the moment I first met you that you were a genuine soul and rare. Little did I know that 17 years ago I was being introduced to my future husband. Taylor and Gavin are so incredibly lucky to have you to guide and support them through life. You love them in a way I could have only hoped for and I thank God every day. You make sure they know their worth, feel loved, and demonstrating family in ways that will shape and mold them for a lifetime. Our path as a couple has been nothing short of serendipity. We've accomplished so much together. Six years of long distance, over 100 plane tickets, and thousands of driven miles. We've conquered loss, monthly drill weekends, a deployment, cross-country moves, Disney World with the children, a pandemic, and assembling IKEA furniture. While our journey took the scenic route, I am grateful because it's uniquely ours. I'm confident that we can crush anything life will throw our way because together we have proven time and time again that our love is stronger. you
one final thought. I hope to always make you proud. Proud of the person that I was, proud of the person that I am, and proud of the person that I will be. Most importantly, proud to be on this journey of life with me. I've loved you in the beginning, I love you now, and I will always love you more and more with each passing day.